we're down here in Fort Walton and we want to try out this place that we found. It's called G.I. Jade. It's a tiki bar. If you know, we like that kind of thing and because we did a video about one that we went to in Hilton Head. So we're going to go try uh, this one out and let you know if it's worth it. you're gonna be able to hear me or not but this is their signature sauce it's some kind of green garlic kind of like tartar sauce but it doesn't taste like tartar sauce it's really good We finished eating here and at GI Jade and I would recommend it. it. Had great atmosphere, location, it was an open air bar area. The food, it was bar food, it was good, drinks were really good, and we enjoyed this place and we would recommend it if you're down here in Fort Walton. So we left one tiki bar, drove 14 miles west here to Navarre, and we're at Juan's Pagoda. I don't know if that's right, but hey, that's where we're headed. So we're taking you to another tiki bar. So we already really like this place. I got a mixed drink and Bill got a beer and it was $12 for both of them. I had to, I had to make sure he got both of them. Because most places you go to around here is going to be 20 bucks. And it's going to be $12 just for mine. So they got good drink prices. Some volleyball going on down below us. The beach volleyball. We loved Juan's Pagoda. I'm, you know, just putting the name. Juana's, Juana. It's here. It is a really cool place. We met, there's a lot of locals and stuff that were hanging out here. So this is like a really little local hangout place. Really nice people. Parking is, parking is very difficult, but hey, it's well worth the park and drinks were super, super cheap. Till next time, like and subscribe.